The Ruin DLC has a crazy number of bugs, secrets, and features that Steel will try to hide away from you. Today, I will reveal all these secrets to you as we delve even deeper into the remains of the Mega Pizzaplex. The Pizzaplex is full to the brim with graffiti, but if we take a closer look at these messages, many of these markings prove that the Freddy we know and love is dead. Rest in Pizza, he was our superstar, superstar I think with a skull, and many forever markings, which I mentioned in my first Ruin Secrets video, where I had no damn idea what they meant. But now I'm leaning towards these forever markings, meaning that Freddy's legacy will live on forever. And let's not forget this broken heart marking. For crying out loud, the present in Freddy's chest is literally a different color than usual. What more can I say? Well, what I can say is that Eclipse is hands down the best character in the Ruin DLC. Wouldn't you agree? However, if you absolutely despise the poor guy, you can straight up delete him from the game entirely. No joke, all you have to do is jump over this slide, run towards this wall, and put the mask on. This simple maneuver allows you to skip the trigger that spawns Eclipse in as you phase through this wall, making him invisible for the entirety of the daycare section. That is until he reboots him, as he just pops back into existence from f knows where. Well, at least we saved our boy in the end from the very evil moon. Steel will have made a lot of important updates to Ruin, but by far the best improvement was that Steel will change the look and animation of the cockroach legs, which look even more horrifying now. What's more horrifying is that the original design of the cockroach is used alongside the new design. So, what was the point, Steel Wool, in spending limited time on cockroaches when you're going to use the original design anyways? Don't ask why I spend my time looking at virtual insects. Instead, I want to play a game. You have three seconds to spot the secret in this room. If you fail, I'll eat all the food in your fridge tonight. Ready? Three. If you said nothing, then you're wrong. There is a table here that holds four plushies of the four glam rocks. However, these plushies are a little different as they show the glam rocks in their destroyed state. Chica has no beak, Freddy got a barber of TikTok shop, Monty is split in half, and Roxy has no eyes, which looks way too unsettling for a game about evil furry robots. Well, isn't this a nice reference to the nice things we did in the pizza flex. What is nice though is that I am in ruin. Maybe. At the end of chapter 8, there is a shelf that holds a cleaning product called Giga Bright. Giga Bright, Giga Monty. I mean, Sewell could have gone with any name, but they went with the word Giga. Yeah. The same word from the most infamous thing in Security Breach. Plus, Sewell are aware of Giga Monty as they removed him with the release of Ruin. This may be a stretch, but at least we have something to remember our friend by. Here's something else to remember. As Sewell love to patch out funny glitches, I have found the craziest glitch ever in spite of steel that breaks the laws of physics all you must do is look in the same direction that you are moving on a ladder and you will stop moving for some reason oh my god okay maybe it's not as game breaking now that i think about it but it is something steel will haven't fixed yet so there's that okay this is actually crazy in chapter 5 outside roxy's hair salon you can find the mysterious note on this wall while using the mask that reads gone for a while money for food on the counter emergency contacts on fridge now what on earth does this mean maybe this is a note from vanessa to gregory as she may have left the pizza plex leaving gregory in the hair salon as the princess quest ending is the canon security breach ending where vanessa takes gregory as her own or maybe it's from after nazi always comes back Bruh. make sure to leave a message in the comment section saying what you think this means since our secret was hard to notice he's a less hard to notice secret we all know that the best arcade game monty golf has made a return in ruin but did you know that the design of this arcade is very different to the Monty Golf Arcade that we are used to. In Ruin, Monty raises his glasses and there is text at the top of the arcade saying the back nine, implying that the arcade contains these scrapped golf holes from Security Breach. Meanwhile, in the base game, Monty has his shades on and his tail is below the water, unlike the Ruin Arcade. Isn't that crazy? What would be crazy is if you watch part one to this video to learn even more secrets that Steel will try to hide away from you. And make sure to join my Discord server link in the description.